Hello everyone, I'm Derek Clark from the Rangers Review outside of Ibrook Stadium after Rangers uh, thumped Dunfermline by five goals to nil in the Premier Sports Cup second round. Rangers needed to deliver a performance after three defeats on the bounce and they sure did that this evening. Eight changes, wholesale changes to the side this evening. John McLaughlin started in goal, a back four of uh, Calvin Bassey, who will come on to him a little bit later on, alongside Connor Goulton, who was skipper for the evening, uh, Jack Simpson, and of course Nathan Patterson coming in for James Tavernier on that right-hand side. In the middle of the park, John Lundstrom returned alongside Glenn Kamara, uh, and alongside uh, them as well was Joe Aribo with a forward line consisting of Scott Wright, Yanis Hadji and uh, Kimar Roof and Rangers certainly started uh, explosively uh, when Calvin Bassey won the ball on the uh, over on the left hand side. He cut the ball back to John Lundstrom and he rifled the ball into the roof of the net and that really set the tone. Scott Wright added the second great through ball it was from Yanis Hadji and the former Aberdeen forward just cut inside before rifling the ball uh, past Mehmet into the back of the net. net uh, Hadji himself got in on the act just two minutes later and Calvin Bassey again was the provider with an absolutely delicious cross ball into his path and Romani nodded home from a few yards out. Bassey really was fantastic in that first half. Rightly named man of the match by the sponsors and pretty much everyone that I was speaking to inside Ibrox um, this evening. It was sensational uh, was the former Leicester City kid. Uh, Kima Roof added uh, uh, Rangers fourth goal on 33 minutes. A great strikers finish this one on the right hand side into uh, the back of the net and that's how uh, the scoreline remains at half time. They came out the second half Rangers uh, and they added uh, the fifth goal of course, Kimar Roof winning uh, the penalty uh, himself, being brought down by Graham Dorans inside the box. He stepped up himself and unleashed the ball uh, into the corner of the net, giving Mehmet absolutely no chance. Rangers were on easy street. They brought the likes of Alfredo Morelos, Scott Arfield and Stephen Kelly on in that second half. And rousing receptions, especially for Scott Wright, who was absolutely fantastic again this evening. Another impressive performance from him. Plenty of running, great invention uh, and th full of industry. There's a point in 61 minutes when he showed great skill. He burst through from his own half, skinned a player uh, before playing a 1-2 with Nathan Patterson. It really was a joy to watch. Uh, other than that, uh, the likes of uh, uh, as we mentioned, Glenn Kamari was brought off for uh, Stephen Kelly, was given a, a great reception uh, as well, as was Yanis Hadji uh, also. He went down holding his lower back on, on 32 minutes. It looked a tad worrying. It looked like he, well, he received a bit of treatment uh, just after Kimar Roof scored uh, and he went down again on 36 minutes, but he soldiered on uh, and he came through it and he produced a, a tremendous performance uh, from the Romanians. So, as we mentioned, Rangers really had to deliver a statement display here after uh, three successive defeats and they certainly did that uh, tonight. Dunfermline, by all accounts, they were poor. Um, a lot of talk in the press box about Peter Grant is, and his naivety with the side that he put out here uh, this evening. He certainly has his own problems to seek, but for Steven Gerrard and this Rangers side, they march on into the next round of the League Cup with a superb dominant display here at Ibrox this evening. We've got the uh, Man by Mans on the Rangers Review website and we've also got a terrific article by Jonathan McFarlane on there as well looking at the impressive display of Calvin Bassey. So make sure you get on there. Remember it's only £1 a month for the first six months. Great introductory offer for top quality journalism covering the team you love. Thanks very much for watching. Bye bye for now.